Now, we only have to look at the government's movement and go back to the Road Safety Remuneration Tribunal to see how quick the government is to kick aside the matter of workers' rights. The Road Safety Remuneration Tribunal was put in place to pay truck drivers a fair wage, to make sure when they're out on the road they can pay their bills and feed their families. But the second that the Road Safety Remuneration Tribunal attempted to bring in minimum wages in order to combat unsafe contracts, which are causing death and serious injuries on our roads and in the trucking industry, the government went into an absolute frenzy. We can't have people being paid proper wages. Deputy Speaker, more than 200 truck drivers die in Australia each and every year. The government took the easy way out. Instead of addressing these deaths, protecting Australians, it completely destroyed the RSRT. Turning a blind eye to the unbearable conditions, uh, unbelievable conditions and pressures that truck drivers are, under, are expected to work under. This government time and time again ignores the advice of experts. When the National Transport Commission uh, demonstrated the clear link, the clear link between safety outcomes and truck driver pay rates, the government feigned ignorance. By axing the RSRT, the government took away protections for whistleblowers in the industry who were concerned about the safety of their workplaces and took away their rights to take leave without losing contracts. It was and is an appalling short-sighted move by a government, just a way for them to point at something tangible, to give them a win during their time in government. 